Yo, what up? This T Real. Hey, look, I just want to say this right here that, you know what I'm saying? That I'm sick of people, you know what I'm saying, with the pettiness, you know what I mean? We could be adults and we can be mature about a certain situation. Now, I understand even as an, even as adults, you know, we have we have childish tendencies in us. Everybody don't do everything in a mature manner. I understand that. But when you know that you are being petty and you just don't care and you make it a habit of doing it, that's a problem right there, man. You know what I mean? You know, I'm I'm talking about stuff where a guy just doing stuff, a female just doing stuff. And one thing that I don't like for a female to do is when she like, let's say she get her nails or she get a pedicure or something. I don't like for her to be showing off. You know what I'm saying? It's like, you know, or if I was in a relationship, I wouldn't want her to be showing off something that I like. It's all right to... It's all right that, you know what I'm saying, wear your stuff and be happy about what you got. But when you get to the point where you just going around people showing off, uh, you think that you think this look good on me? Uh, look, look, you think this look good on me? Or you pull somebody to the side, have them sit down so you can put your leg on them or, you know, put a certain body part on them to say, you think that look good on me? That's a that's attention. You want attention. If you know that you look good and you know you about your stuff, you don't need all these opinions going from place to place being flashy. I can't stand that shit. You know what I mean? And any bitch that do that, you know what I'm saying? She can't fuck with me, you know, because she petty. Make me want to smack her ass because she's a bitch. Y'all might think this shit is funny, but I'm serious with this shit. And I can't stand when motherfuckers show off. Like, I knew a bunch of niggas that like to show off. They get two-faced, so I stop fucking with them for it be a certain issue. So, you know, I, I ask people to respect my wishes on that not being flashy shit and not being petty just to make me feel a certain kind of way. You know, if I don't do it to you, I don't deserve it. You see what I'm saying? And I know I'm a fucking good person. I might not do everything right, but I don't do shit out of spite to people. You know what I mean? So I'm just going to say this right here. Listen right here. Listen. Listen. This is for all the people who want to be petty and play child games. When I get mad, my attitude is not going to tame because I'm going to retaliate and make you pay for what you did. And I know how to do it to the point where I'm not going to do a bid. I'm sick of people being flashy as shit. If I put my hands on them, I'm going to do more than just one hit because they need to know that it's not cool to do that. My attitude is crazy. The beast is where I'm at. Shoot. And when I say that, I mean there's a beast within me. It's sleeping. It ain't dead. If somebody cross that line, the beast will get fed because it's going to take care of all the frustrate that I got. I'm so sick of people, man. They're going to get got. Why do people just like to see how far they can go? See, me, if if angels are going down the road, I'm going to go with the flow. Because if I don't, I'm going to do something that's going to put me in the dark. Meaning jail or even going to hell. I don't need that. Therefore, I'm not going to have to pay the bail. You know, if a female cares about herself, she don't have to be flashy. She's beauty. She, her beauty is by her mind and her face. And that makes her classy. She don't have to go showing off just because something good happened. And she don't have to constantly go around people blabbing about what she got. What's the point of that yapping? All I'm saying is, you're going to have to respect your wishes if you want me to stay around. Otherwise, I'll be gone, just like animals in a dog pound. Yo, I'm out. Always remember, karma is a mug. What goes around comes around. You're going to get yours too. It's going to come back to you, bite you. It's going to come back to bite you. I'm out.
One love, T-Real.